antibodies, proteins made by our body to kill foreign invaders. We are constantly under attack from bacteria and viruses. And at the same time, we also face threats from within, such as emerging cancer cells. While some of us won't even notice these attacks, others can get seriously ill. This is due to the uniqueness of our immune systems, including our body's individual ability to make the right antibody to deal with a specific threat. The powerful and sophisticated human immune system can make quintillions of slightly different antibodies. That's billions of billions, a nearly infinite resource. When one of these antibodies turns out to be successful at its job, the body starts making more and more copies. As a result of the lifelong training and adaption of our immune system, what appears to be a simple trial and error system is in fact something far more clever. At any given moment, we only make those antibodies that are really needed, meaning that only about a couple hundred or thousand will ever be dominantly present in our blood. To tackle diseases, human antibodies need to be as unique and flexible as dancing human bodies. What if we could discover which antibody fights which threat the best, and then turn these antibodies into biotherapeutics? We could then use them to treat patients who are not making the right antibodies, or not making enough of them. This would bring us close to something that represents a cure for just about every disease, a cure that stems from within our own body. Using mass spectrometry-based protein analysis, we can now directly monitor the repertoire of antibodies present in blood. Just a few droplets is enough for us to measure how a person is responding to an infection or vaccination. As a result, we can search for specific antibodies present in those who do not get ill, enabling us to identify the optimal weapon against the disease in question. The quest for the most powerful antibodies is only just beginning, but the solution to any disease might just come from within you.